What's going on, Lee Gen Bs? It's your boy, Matty Ice Leads for Locals. I'm really excited to do this video because um, this is a feature I've been waiting for for a little while to come out and go high level. It is the membership upsell feature, which is basically going to hopefully allow us to make more sales when it comes to our courses, membership sites. So um, if you have courses or membership sites that you sell uh, in your business, this is definitely going to be the video for you. So make sure you stick to the end. I'm going to show you how I'm using this in my business, how to get it set up, uh, how to customize it, a couple of different strategies, et cetera. Uh, my only ask as usual, guys, is if you find the video helpful, please smash that like button. Make sure you subscribe. Check out all the links in the description. Always have good stuff for you guys there. I'm going to have some additional training on creating membership sites, creating the sales pages and automations and all that stuff. So make sure you check that out because uh, we're just talking about the upsell feature in this video. And uh, if you don't have Go High Level, if you don't mind, please uh, support the channel. Go through my affiliate link for it in the description. It really does help, and I appreciate it, guys. All right, let's rock and roll. So we are in the sites tab. We go to memberships and click on offers. So I want to talk uh, just for a second about how uh, like one of the ways that I'm using this. And um, it's actually through the free uh, membership sites that I have. So one of one part of my business is affiliate marketing. You don't have to do this for affiliate marketing, but hopefully this will give you an idea of uh, some different ways to do things in your business, uh, different ways to deliver your free lead magnets where when you're generating uh, or you're building your list and generating leads um, instead of just sending them to a video or a page or something like that, consider maybe sending them into a free membership area because uh, there's a lot of different things that you can do with it. But anyways, this is one part of my business. And um, now hopefully it's going to allow me to uh, sell more of my my courses, right? Because, uh, you know, I have my email follow up, text follow up, I bring people into my Facebook group, and that does sell my various different courses throughout the month, which is great. But this is just uh, kind of an extra way to hopefully get additional sales, right? Because what this allows us to do is actually put your uh, uh, membership site or like uh, paid or upsell, uh, upsold membership site into the actual library, as well as a one click upsell. So there's a couple of different ways to do this. But uh, basically, what I'm doing with this is uh, I'm offering free snapshot, like go high level snapshots in specific industries, which comes with like a funnel uh, or, or, or a website, has some basic automations, like some emails, text messages, maybe a database reactivation campaign, stuff like that. Right. But instead of sending them to a page uh, or a video or whatever, I, I actually give them login credentials for a free membership site that has step-by-step -step training on how to customize it, how to use it and things like that. Cause I want people to actually use what I'm giving them. So membership sites are a great way to deliver your free lead magnets. And now with this membership upsell feature, in addition to like when they log in and, and they see the free lead magnet and, and they get access to it right next to that will be your paid course or your paid membership site right there. So it's really, really cool. So that's one of the ways that I'm doing this right now. And uh, but what what you want to do to actually get this set up, it's actually really easy. Um, I'm going to use the one that I've already set up here as an example. Uh, this is my free life insurance funnel and marketing kit. All right. So I'm going to click this. So you need to go to your offer where you want to create the upsell. So it can, it can be a paid course. That's where you can use the one click upsell. Uh, or if you're doing a free membership site, then you would just do uh, here. I'll show you if we click upsell right here and then add upsell. Uh, you have two options right now. You can do a one click upsell. This is if people are giving you their credit card information, uh, which in the, the case of my my free membership sites, obviously they're not doing that. So I'm going to use the in app sell, which basically, again, it puts your paid membership site in the library. And when they click it, there's like a little mini sales page that pops up and they could purchase it. All right. So that's what we're going to do. Um, so yeah, uh, so literally, so just kind of back up recap really quick on how to get this set up, go to your offer, and then you're going to click the upsell button here. And you're going to click add upsell. Okay. And I'm going to do I'm going to choose in app upsell for now. Uh, we're going to click continue. And then you're going to select the offer for your paid membership site. Okay. And, and if you don't have that stuff set up, guys, again, I'm going to have additional training in the description on how to get your offer and product set up, all the automations, how to build the membership site. Um, I walk you through that step by step in another training, but I'm assuming you already have that. Uh, so I'm going to choose, let's see, let's do, which one, uh, what else do I want here? Um, let's do my Facebook ads mastery course. Why not? All right. So we're going to add upsell offer. All right. We'll give that a second come up and now uh, basically we're just going to customize it. Here's the thing, guys. I don't like to overcomplicate stuff. I would recommend that 
you don't do that either. Oh my goodness. Sorry. Hang on. Uh, I got some lag going on. All right. There we go. Sorry about that. Um, don't, don't overcomplicate this guys. Don't worry about it being like super professional and, and all that stuff. Just put some basic customization into, uh, into this. Um, you don't really need to do anything crazy. All right. So, um, you can see I have enroll for $0 right now. So this, uh, this is like an old offer that I do, but it would, it would say whatever your price is right here. So enroll for 497 or 997, whatever. All right. So um, that goes back to creating your actual offer for this. But I just want to show you guys how to get this set up. So the first thing we're going to do is go into details here and you can actually change. Uh, so this the title right here is this part right here. So if you want to change that, you can do that. And then um, I like to, uh, you know, you can also change the banner background color. So I'll change this to black for now. All right. And then we click save up here. All right, so that changes the, the background right there. And then you can also add a subtitle below the, the, the headline here and say, um, you know, let's see. Uh, so what am I talking about? Uh, Facebook Ads Mastery Course. Everything you need to crush it with Facebook ads. Okay. <clears throat> um, all right. So whatever you want to put for your, your subtitle there. All right, so we have our headline, we have our sub headline right there. They have a button right here to actually enroll. Here's the, the um, image of the course. Also, you can, uh, you can change the purchase button as well. So you, there's some pretty good customization here. You can also add a video here. I'm kind of going back and forth on whether or not I want to add a video. Um, I might recommend it because, I mean, video sells really good. And uh, um, like I already have video demos on all of my sales pages for all of my courses and products. So it wouldn't be a bad idea. Like if you have a demo walkthrough of your, uh, of your product, you can actually add it to the sales page right here. So I'll, I'll just show it to you really quick. <clears throat> all right. Uh, let's see. Um, I'm going to add, I'm, I'm just going to add a random one here. Let's just, let's just do this. All right, so, uh, but you would download the video, upload it. Um, I wish you could embed or use like a YouTube URL. Hopefully um, they'll let us do that at some point later on down the future. But for now, you just have to, you have to download the video and actually upload it. Uh, you know, this type of video selling your, your product uh, or, or your course, it really shouldn't be that long anyways. So, um, but here's where your video will show up. And then I imagine we could change the background color there. Uh, let's see, background... I'm not really sure where to do that. Um, I'm sure it's here somewhere. I'm just missing it. But anyways, not 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 a big deal. I was talking about like this background color right here, but that's fine. But uh, you, you can add video and then uh, you can also add a background image right here. Again, you know, I just I don't think any of this is really necessary. Uh, you don't have to go too crazy with this. Um, I would say to add a description. So if, uh, if we click edit here, maybe you add some bullet points on what they're going to get in this program. Because um, uh, again, you don't have to go crazy because um, they actually see the curriculum, which I really like this part uh, about the upsell feature is it shows them all of the lessons, all of the, the categories and everything inside of the course. So they see exactly what they're going to get. But if you want to maybe put a quick description or summary, you know, maybe three to five bullet points of the main things that they're going to learn, you can do that. So uh, let, let, I'll just show you what it looks like here. Step by step, uh, Facebook ads, video training library, something like that, right? Okay, and then maybe we bold this. And this is a glitch right now. I'm not really sure why we can't do this. I imagine they'll, you know, go high level, get this fixed at some point. Um, the, the, the three little dots doesn't work either, but that's okay. You know, just, uh, I'm, I'm sure that's some, something that they're working on, uh, click save. And then the description is going to be just below, I think the video, if I remember correctly, if you scroll down, yeah, right here. All right. So this is where your description shows up. I do like normally, uh, to make the, the font bigger, you would, uh, click right here and then choose like, he like one of the headline sizes, but for some reason it's just not, it's just not showing up. So, but not a big deal. All right, hopefully they'll get that fixed at some point. And then uh, I think that's about it. I mean, you can you can mess around with the course body a little bit here if you want. I'm going to say just leave it alone because, again, you don't have to you don't have to go crazy with all of this stuff. You know, the, the point is we're, we're getting more ex uh, additional exposure for our product and services here. So um, and then uh, once you once you've customized this, go ahead and change this to active and then save it again. And when they log into their library, 
uh, then you're good to go. Like um, here, I'll, I'll, let me see if I can show you a quick example of this. Uh, let's do a preview. I think this will let me actually log into it. Yeah, here we go. So let me do, let's see. I'm going to use an old email address here. All right, so you can see what it looks like. Hopefully this works. All right, let's view dashboard. All right, but basically they're just going to see their their original offer, like or whatever they purchased, or if it's a free membership site, and boom, here it is. Look at this. This is awesome, guys. I love this. This is so freaking cool. So every time they log into your membership uh, area and they go to their library, and you know, here's the free you know, snapshot or free lead magnet that I offered in the first place. But now right here, they can see my, my paid program. You know, they see the price right here. They can click this and then it takes them to that sales page that we uh, put together. It, um, not what we just did, but I already have this one done. So, uh, you know, here's like step, you know, some bullet points about what they're going to get. Here's the course curriculum. Ah, I just love this. This is so cool. And, and now they can, they can actually enroll and purchase it good to go. But you don't even need to make a sales page for it. Like th this, it, this is the sales page when you're creating the actual upsell, your, uh, it, like in the membership area, uh, the dashboard. So I just really love this guys. Obviously you're going to make sure you want to have your automation put in place too, you know, for each, um, what did I just do? I don't think I meant to do that, but whatever. Um, make sure you have your automations in place for each, uh, offer and product. But again, that's, you know, I got training on that in the description, but that's uh that's really all you have to do guys. Uh, what I just showed you step-by-step step, creating these upsells, you would do the same thing. Uh, like here, here's your upsell. So, uh, if you want to get rid of one, you can also change them from active to inactive. I'm going to go ahead and delete this for now. All right. And then right here, you can add your one click upsell to, uh, later on, if you want, like a lot of different things you can do pretty simple stuff, but really powerful. Uh, just the more exposure you can get, uh, the more product exposure you can get to your audience, the more sales you're going to make, period, right? So uh, anyways, that's it, guys, for this video. I hope that was helpful. Drop some comments down below. I would love to hear your feedback. Uh, I'm really excited about this, and uh, I will uh, keep you guys posted on the results of it. So I uh, hope you guys are crushing it, and I will talk to you in the next one. Matty Ice is out.